Welcome back guys! Once upon a time we promised to show you how to make panna cotta. If you wanna see us make panna cotta, don't comment below because we'll do it anyway. Panna cotta is Italian for cooked cream, which sounds really weird but it tastes really good. First we want to take <laughs> Sorry, cameraman. A bowl. Then we take milk and one packet of gelatin. This is a quarter ounce, I believe, which is how much we want. Uh, we're gonna get a third cup of milk. The third cup. There it is. Do, 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 do. Pour that in there. So this is the first step, which is setting the gelatin. Or letting the gelatin set, or I don't know. It's basically just letting the gelatin gel up in a cold liquid. Give it a little stir. Now we're gonna move over to the stove while this gets ready. Oh yeah, I threw the box. <laughs> Taz isn't here to chew it up. All right, we want two and a half cups of whipping cream, heavy whipping cream. What's the difference? I don't know. That's one cup. I think this pot is big enough. We're gonna try. Another cup. And another half cup. I described panna cotta as somewhere in between pudding, jello. It's kind of like a creme brulee too, almost. That's true. Yeah, I think pudding, jello, and creme brulee. It's like if you had a diaphragm, <laughs> you'd be right in the middle. <laughs> Diagram. Good morning. <laughs> Half a cup of sugar. There are a lot of ways you can flavor your panna cotta, like coffee or raspberry, hazelnut, but we're just doing the good old plain, and then we'll top it with whatever the hell we want. Stir heavy cream and sugar over medium heat until it boils. And then once it starts to boil, we're going to stir in the gelatin mixture. While we wait for this to boil, I can thank my good friend Maddie for making this super awesome shawl. Oh, what am I thinking? A watched pot never boils. Okay, I call that a boil. So, we're going to do this. Spoosh. <laughs> Everyone step back. Stir it in until completely dissolved and cook for one minute. 15 minutes on the clock. 15 minutes? Good morning. <laughs> Alexa, dismiss timer. <laughs> one and a half. Oh my gosh! Want one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. When? <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with a little extra vanilla, right? <laughs> Today's not my day. Stir, stir, stir. Okay, so we removed from heat, stirred in vanilla, and turned off the stove. It calls for six ramekins like this but we've only found four of them. So I read you can also put them in muffin tins. So we're gonna try these little silicone guys and hope that it works. You can also do them in like glasses or like bowls. You can just spoon it out that way, but we're gonna actually try popping them out. So hopefully these will also be handy for that. I'm gonna pour this in some sort of pouring thing, a pitcher. That'd be overkill. <laughs> Here goes nothing. It's too much, okay. Hopefully this way we'll have extra little ones so we can do more experimentation. I don't want any spillage. <laughs> I'm making a mess. Now I'm a little nervous because we have to move these into the fridge. <laughs> what if you set them on like a cookie sheet so you have like a, a stable base for them? Yeah. This hasn't been on the floor or anything. 
Strawberries. Strawberries. This thing's heavy. Best case scenario, you refrigerate it overnight, but we're gonna take them out this evening. The recipe says at least four hours in the fridge. This is very delicate work. Oh, I have like just enough room, huh? Yeah, looks like it. I should have opened both doors. Freeze well. Okay, well now we're gonna clean up, but we won't make you watch that. And we'll see you this evening. It has been eight hours. I am dying to find out how these are. They look all right. So, we've got a variety of toppings here. We've got chocolate shavings, strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, pistachios, cocoa nibs, some melted caramel, as well as a couple of sauces that Cullen's mom made. There's chocolate amaretto. Is that how you say it? Amaretto. 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 <laughs> and then a vanilla one as well. <laughs> there are five of us who are going to be eating this and we've got 15, so that's three each. Plenty of room for experimentation. Choose three of your liking and try plopping them out. <laughs> like flop. <laughs> yes, okay. we've never done it this way. We've only ever scooped it, so you are the trailblazer here. Okay. <laughs> oh oh no! <laughs> it stretches with it. Uh, Do you want two extra hands? Say, uh, we may need to give it. Oh, 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 wait! Yes! Nice. Oh, it looks like a white chocolate. Reese's Cup. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead. There you go. Just get one. There you go. <laughs> this is a hydrogen dioxide molecule. <laughs> what? Wait, what? <laughs> that doesn't look like hydrogen dioxide. That looks like hydrogen da sugaride. Oh, wow. Okay, what is this? That's caramel. And chocolate? Amaretto. Chocolate amaretto. Mm. Uh, um, amar uh, amaretto. I need to stop trying. <laughs> oh, and just, oh man, and you're rocking it. Mom's much what better. What a pro. Than I will ever be. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like yours melted. <laughs> oh, this is hot. <laughs> oh, nice. Mm. I'll give it a little crown of chocolate. Mm, a little bit of fruit. <gasps> no sauces or no oh, sauces. Oh, go on oh, the fruit. Yeah. I see. Why are you scooting me over? The plate's well, right there. In there, open it. You can just do it. <laughs> it's not that difficult. Family feuds. Quarantine. <laughs> you get right. a cotta out of the silicon molds. No, that's not quarantine. That's all the time. <laughs> right. A little messy. Slice. That's okay. That's lovely. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot of surface area. I think that's a good idea. Caramel and pistachio. That's Seems what like I was it should go together. Perfect. Okay. Good Good for it. It. All right, and then we'll film you, or you have to do it while holding the camera. <laughs> I can try. <laughs> sure, it's possible. <laughs> yeah, not bad. I'm going to. Follow suit on the caramel pistachio plan. Pistachio. I don't think we can be artsy with this <laughs> consistency. You could <can> try. Ah! <laughs> Artists find a way. Then it's like, art, you know. I was say Jackson Paul, it's impressionistic. Like maybe. Yeah. It's impressionist. <laughs> All right, That's I'm good. gonna try not to make a mess. <laughs> we'll bring the plate to it. There you go. <laughs> Oh, oh, wow, you're not, you're not behaving oh, raspberries. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Oh, this one. No, nope, okay. <laughs> I think it's the panna cotta. It's like, get this off of me. Okay. You ready be to be artsy? Sure. Oh. <laughs> sure. I'm just gonna go. Oh, mm. yeah. That 
sort of worked. <laughs> and then... <laughs> You'll be scraping your plate to get that. Oh yeah. I mean, we've got a lot, so... <laughs> you know, <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> Sign me up for culinary school. <laughs> your turn. Ooh, fun. Time to multitask, my man. <laughs> <laughs> you may need to you may need to set the camera on the no, table. No, <laughs> he will be successful just the way he is. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Almost. Ooh. Dang. Impressive. Dang. <laughs> I'm gonna try something a little different than everybody oh, else. Gosh. Okay. Are you gonna do a sandwich? Oh, uh, you know it. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck moving it though. No. <laughs> it's okay, everything's fine. All right, I think there goes. Got it. All right, I think let's I'm see how spoon. hard this will be to move. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you got it. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> Shoot a caramel in the middle. Oh, so, yeah, you're right. Oh. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, no. <laughs> it was a valiant try. Okay, now what? <laughs> uh, Are you still happy holding the camera? <laughs> let's do some chocolate, because I bet that would be good. <laughs> Just dump it. Just dump it. Oh, on I there. didn't put chocolate on mine. The lady. <laughs> <laughs> Is it caramel or caramel? If it's expensive, it's caramel. Uh. Let's just add some blueberries. He really hasn't had any caramel. Let's top off our strawberries with it. Oh yeah. Should cool. we? Uh... Sure, pick your favorite. Start with. Okay. First tea. Yep. Mm. Let's go. Mm. Very tasty. Mm. That's good. Declare your favorite combination when you've tried them all. Mm. And comment below your own ideas. Mm. Oh, you put on panna cotta. Wow, they're all different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pretty cool. I like the pistachio caramel. Oh, that one's yeah. good, yeah. Mm -hmm. But then the chocolate berries is really hard to beat. Um, um. I think the amaretto. 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 You can also say am. Amaretto. Amaretto. I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. <laughs> sure, 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 sure. Well, Delaney, would you say your panna cotta was a success? Yeah, you know, it maintained its form, which we were not sure about. And it tastes good, so I'm happy. <laughs> okay, so the key is a flexible mold, apparently, to pop them out because it kind of sticks <laughs> Yeah, they a stick a lot. <laughs> mm -hmm. Supposedly, if you have them in ramekins, you can dip them briefly in hot water, and then they should come out. Mm. Well, I think we all agree this was a success, and highly recommend you try this at home because it's really not that hard. The hardest part is just waiting for it to solidify in the fridge. Yeah, and having enough fridge space to do it. Yes, that's another <laughs> another one. If that's you... a great during quarantine. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week. See you guys. Bye.